Hi everyone! Before I really start this video, I just want to do a big shout out to MB Equestrian here on YouTube. She is a fellow Norwegian equestrian YouTuber and I think everyone should go and give her a subscribe because when she hits 300 subscribers she will do a giveaway so and that is a pretty good giveaway so go out there and check out her channel subscribe and i will of course link her down in the description so you can click straight to her video so please do that hi everyone and welcome back to my channel uh this video will be filmed on my phone uh, because i couldn't get my camera to work i don't know why but that happens uh today i just thought that i would just film a collective haul i do have some stuff that i know that i haven't shown in attack haul so why not just show it in like a collective haul uh right now i'm horse ls but uh when work starts up again after summer and stuff like that and the horse is getting back horses are getting back from pasture i am gonna try out a horse so stay tuned for that I'm also in a new setting. I finally made my room look a little bit more uh, camera friendly, so yeah. But let's just get on to this tack or collective haul. If it's not much tack, but like collective haul. So the thing we're gonna start off with, I think I wanna start with like the smallest to the biggest items, yeah. So the first thing I'm gonna start with is that I, when I went to Has 360 camp or Camp 360, uh, I, we got like a little goodie bag, like this Kingsland goodie bag thing. Um, I love like these handy nets because I use them in my, in my backpack for clothes and stuff. And then we've got up in that one, we've got like two um, hats. This is like the Has 360 logo hat and it's black and then we've i got this uh, red kingsland hat i do love hats it's a necess necessary thing for me to use at the barn because i hate getting ha hay in my hair so they are very handy dandy and one other thing we got in that um goodie bag was this and this is absolutely so cool i think this is like the coolest thing we got it's like this little, um, not a purse, not like a, what do you call it? Yeah, like these little bags, you can fit your phone in it. Like if you have a big phone, it fits in here. And if you have a smaller phone, it fits, it fits in here. So, and you can take a, like a waist bag, waist bag, not a waist bag, yeah, whatever. You can put it around your waist with, with this clip and you can have your phone with you when you ride if you don't have a pocket and it came in really handy when we were in the mountains riding so thumbs up for that one the next thing i've got is from horseplay apparel um i am an ambassador for horseplay apparel and if you use my code veronica10 you can get 10 percent off your order and i have linked everything down below like my code and horseplay apparel so the first thing i've got like I think I got it last year, but I never put it in a haul, but I love this one. It's this emerald long sleeve, like Technic uh, call um, shirt, and it's lovely to ride in. And it has this logo on the side, which is Horseplay Apparel, established in 2011. So it's really nice. I love it, and I have ridden so much in it. And now I am waiting on a matching saddle pad which I will put in. That's the one thing I'm waiting on. I'm waiting to pick up my saddle pad, um, which I am gonna show you in this video, but just a future me, yeah. So here is future me with my new saddle pad. It's the Piers of Sweden uh, dressage, dressage cut in the color Emerald. So let me do this with you guys. Oh, satisfying. Bees of Sweden. Love it. It also has the chocolate brown uh, piping with the binding that is silver, white and 
emerald green with some silver bindings here it's so gorgeous it's this um satin material it's white underneath here and it has a quote on here that says dreams do come true so i've been eyeing this for the longest time finally i got it so yay so there's that and the other thing i got from horseplay apparel recently is this awesome shirt which says uh, life's tough wear a helmet and it's in blue and it has like a, it's a little bit longer back than in the front and it's the material is just amazing so i have been wearing this at home in these warm days and it's just i just love it so horseplay apparel everyone and then i got also from horseplay apparel i got these towels which says muscle and boots so it's like a grooming towels which comes in a pack of two here you can see a muscle and the black one says boots so if i ever go on a show but most likely i will use it when i groom uh for someone at a show so you can have those in handy and then i have these clips on that you can just clip onto your grooming bag or your groom backpack then i got some halters um this halter you have seen on Attila on most pictures because he looked just absolutely stunning in it i won this uh this is from the brand covalero and it has rose gold buckles and it's dark blue with like rose gold stitching and it's just amazing and it's got this really weird lock on it which actually is quite good because no one steals your lead rope because the lead rope came with it and it's also like the same color as the halter and here is like the lock yeah. <laughs> it's magnetic so you just have this one and it just locks into it and then you can open it like this and it just locks through so until i has tried to like uh come out of this a few times because he pulled some he pulled sometimes when he wanted grass so that didn't actually work with this so which i'm very happy about so i'm just gonna roll up this so i think these lead ropes were actually kind of cool so i don't i know you can get these from a store named petster and i think horse actually had some of them in but they are from the brand covaliero so you can get them at you can see if you can get them at a website or something um yeah going for the rose gold theme i also have this halter which is the same halter not the same halter i've got another one of these but it's the same type you can win in my giveaway which i'm giving out when i reach 1010 subscribers so yeah it's this black halter with rose gold buckles and this is from the brand horse guard and this also looked very nice on attila uh, the halters are in full by the way next thing up is also a halter uh <laughs> it's the same one from horse guard um only in sort of this burgundy color and it also has uh, these rose gold buckles and with them uh these are yeah these are from horse guard i think i bought them from fellas but yeah it's sort of a tractor supply thing we have here in norway and then from Herx, i got this black lead rope with a rose gold buckle which is also part of the giveaway a lead rope that matches the black halter so that is also what i got I know I haven't said any prices on this, but if I found out the prices, because it's a, I got something on sale and yeah. So if I find the prices, I will put it in with the things that I'm showing. Yeah, then before it actually got confirmed that Attila had to leave us, 
and go to the uh, horse heaven <laughs> I actually got him some new hay bags in rainbow which are actually <laughs> just ikea bags but everyone's got like blue ikea bags or they got the black like sort of um knockoffs of ikea bags so sometimes i really had i really did struggle finding a tellers uh, hay bags because yes they were red but there was another horse that had red hay bags and like in every every hay bag for every horse it was like a chaos to find so i wanted something to stick out and but I never got to use them, so it's so sad. No, I'm not gonna cry, but yeah. So these hay bags in like the rainbow collection from Ikea. I got four of these. Um, then, it's a bit since I got this, but I have done a review on them, but I'm just gonna show them. They are so dirty right now, so don't look at them. But yeah, these muck boots from Noble Outfitters Muds. Hang on. 10 seconds later. Now I seriously need some editing because I had to jump out. But uh, the next thing I got were, yeah, these Noble Outfitters Muds because I needed something that was waterproofed to actually use at the barn. So I've got those. I've worn. I have worn them now in snow, in rain, in hot hot weather, and they are absolutely amazing. So, if you want to know more about them, check out the review video. Um, <laughs> I'm going pretty fast here, but the next thing I got, uh, which I know you all have seen in videos, but I was uh, like leading Attila around and leading him with like a big rug where he didn't get his shoulder freedom so I got this rug for him uh, which I have home now I'm not gonna take it out but it's this walker rug from Horsewear Amigo it's a hundred grams walker rug and it's waterproof so yeah I've got this one and then I won, and I won another rug. I have one of these. Um, I have one of these rugs because I won sort of the same thing. But one time I won Sunshine of the Month um, title at this blogger community in Norway called Hestodalo. And last year, so I got the prize in. In 2020 but it was like for 2019 yeah so I also got the what do you call it like the blogger award uh, years this year's sunshine title so I got another rug <laughs> which is from from Hastodano and it's actually just a brown waterproofed rug uh yeah from i really do not know what brand it is honestly um but yeah i won that so it's a rain sheet or rain cover or rain rug for horses and i got it in 155 which is Attila's size so if I ever get a horse I need that size so that's my criteria he has to use the same size in um, rugs so yeah no I have one more thing that I recently got which I honestly really do need when I'm in Bergen um, I do have these amazing rain covers or rain trousers to ride in from Stiana which is also somewhere in the video, in my videos, which is a review of them. But I didn't really have like a raincoat that really held the rain out. So when I got my back pay for tax money, I decided that I had to invest in a good like uh, jacket for rain. And I also thought that I was going to walk Attila for a little bit more uh, so I really needed something long but this is also a riding rain jacket um, it's very big so I will put up a picture around here somewhere 
but I swear everyone that has a horse in Bergen about okay not everyone but around 90% of people who owns a horse or loans a horse or rides in Bergen or on the west coast of Norway anyway I think own this one so it's a jacket it's a long, long jacket uh, I bought it in a size too big um, I realized that but in the winter I can get an extra jacket underneath so it doesn't matter but it has like high waist on the collar on it and it has high waist on the end of the sleeves and it also has high waist underneath here and you have some buckles in here not buckles but velcro in here you can tie to your leg so it doesn't blow away when you're sitting on a horse and it sort of covers like almost like a quarter sheet on the horse when you sit down and you can like unbutton it here so it will go over the saddle and stuff when you are sitting on a horse so and it also has like this big uh hood which you can detach if you don't want it on so yeah that's what i got i think i have to just put up a picture of this one because it's big and i can't show it like now i need someone to film me but right now i'm home alone so yeah so that is everything that i got uh <laughs> so i hope you enjoyed the haul and i hope i will be filming more videos for you guys and it works out with the new lone horse and everything um i will take you along on that journey when i have something to film of course so yeah and until then take care wash your hands and i see you in my next video bye